I normally don't shop at Trader Joe's, but I just came to get some. I came to get some Brussels sprouts. But as I'm, you know, looking, look, they don't have no edge, y'all. There's no ads. <laughs> we didn't receive any eggs today. We are sorry. Did y'all have eggs yesterday? Yeah, we had them yesterday, but sold out today. Oh, wow. So they sold out. We just send them no eggs today. No eggs. And this is in located in Pinole, California. Oh, and their butter is three sixty nine. Not bad. That's not bad. Well, if you buy eggs, you probably notice that the price has gone up a lot yes. and at some stores you can't even find them yeah and aside from inflation there's something else causing these relatively cheap items to become so expensive an egg shortage mary jane Belieza joins us live from the smiths on decatur and desert inn to explain how this is impacting local restaurants and bakeries mary jane Oh, well, let me tell you, Kirsten, those I spoke to are calling it the great egg hunt as consumers and local businesses are having a hard time finding specific eggs and dealing with rising costs. I literally said the other day, are the chickens on strike? Because why can't I get eggs? It's a big challenge for Jill Schlesinger, owner of Starburst Parlor, the only keto bakery in town. Catering to a specific group of customers like those with celiac or diabetes, she says every ingredient is crucial. It just puts our whole production like to a halt because literally everything we're baking daily has eggs in it. Brian Wachter, the vice president at the Retail Association of Nevada, cites ongoing supply chain issues and new government regulations which removes caged eggs in the market by 2023. This was passed by Nevada legislature last year. And so we do have a, a decrease in supply um, and we have an increase in demand, especially um, as folks are looking for ways to um, reduce the effect of inflation on their budget. Plus the spread of avian flu is impacting all bird populations. The USDA reports the U.S. has lost more than a million hen laying eggs. We are seeing um, the price of commodity price of, of eggs increase. Um, it's starting to fluctuate. In fact, it's down a little bit to where it was in peak um, kind of. Okay, so here's another article. Eggs are being smuggled across the border causing supply shortages. Look at this. The smuggling of eggs, especially from Kilatan to Thailand. This is not even in America. This is in Thailand. So there's an egg shortage everywhere. Wow. And there was no eggs today at Trader Joe's. But there was very few at Sprouts. Okay, here's another article. What is causing the egg shortage? Hmm. I will share this link as well in the description box. Okay, so I'm just replaying this video again. As you can see, there is no eggs. I just went to get some Brussels sprouts because I love their Brussels sprouts. They have the best. But there was no eggs. But I did go to um, Sprouts and they had eggs. Um, the young man told me it was very few that came in. It's not a lot, but they did have eggs at Sprouts. I don't shop at Trader Joe's. Normally, I don't. Mainly Sprouts at the farmer's markets. It could be due because of the avian flu. Who knows? But eggs is vital, I know, for some people during the holidays. Empty shelves. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe to my channel if you would like.